Our legislature in the here in the state remembers those killed in the Armenian genocide. One and a half million people were killed 102 years ago. Denver 7's Connor Wish shares how the Armenian community got its start here in Colorado and why it is still growing. If you're walking along the west side of the capital, you may continue going on by or you might stop because you see some memorials. It's a place where people can come to remember, and especially this week, an opportunity for the survivors to never forget. Every tree starts as a seed. It was a <laughs> scrawny thing, and we didn't think it was going to survive. I but like it, the did. it did. Look at it. <laughs> this tree towers over a corner of history that also started with something simple. When Armenian Pearl Safarian moved to Colorado, I began with the telephone book. Worried her family heritage was lost. I knew something was missing from my life. And then when I found them gradually, I'd invite them to the house. 15 members has now turned into at least 125 families in the Armenians of Colorado organization. Pearl looks at books filled with pictures. Look at that. Oh. And memories. Some bring sadness. When I look at these pictures, that they're all gone. It's the past, you know. It's what we've been through and what we progressed in. It's what Pearl's mom went through in the genocide that keeps many Armenians fighting for justice. She said, when you smell the horrors of death and you see all the slaughter, and the blood all around. As a young kid, you can't forget that. Today we commemorate what I think is the forgotten genocide in our history. Legislators at the Capitol are making sure the state of Colorado never forgets either. While a distant memory may happen again if we fail to act and to act with vigilance. It really brought tears to my eyes because we need to be recognized. The families say it's up to the future generations. I wish my father could have been here with us as well, and I wish all the survivors could have been. To keep the tree and the history underneath growing, so others may stop and take a moment to remember too. This resolution happens every year, but supporters are hoping that this gets the conversation rolling even further in years to come. In Denver, Connor Wist, Denver 7. There is a movie out right now about the Armenian genocide. It is called The Promise.